we've just checked into our airport hotel. We're going to spend one night here in LA, just kind of near the airport. We're flying to Montana tomorrow. We like to always spend one night just to kind of recover from a little bit of the jet lag. And got this big pile of parcels. And there's even more. We had eight packages between my sister and I. In case people are wondering why we get so many things shipped to our hotel, it's because these are things that either don't ship to Australia or if they do, it's really, really expensive. So it's much better value for us to ship it to our hotel. They store these for free and then we just pick them up when we get here and then we just put them in our suitcase and take them home. My first food ranch that I'm having after touching down in the United States, a pink drink with coconut milk. currently 5 43 in the morning our flight leaves at 7 20 so we have a lot of time to kill so we're at the delta terminal we're going to be boarding our flight to salt lake city and then our connecting flight heads to montana we got our lattes from the coffee bean i've got an iced caramel latte week and i asked for none of the powder because the powder contains dairy ingredients but the syrup doesn't, so I just got the flavoured syrup. We also grabbed some snacks. Holly got some pretzel crisps. I got two bananas because they looked like they're actually pretty ripe. And we also grabbed some waters. And here's my lunchbox for the plane. I got this for free with a popcorn at a cinema or something. I've got an apple, complete cookie, and I've got a cliff bar and just some other like leftover snacks. This is my favorite complete cookie flavor. It's the Snickerdoodle. I've tried pretty much all of them and this one and the birthday cake are my favorite. It's so good. I think I'm gonna eat this now and maybe a banana and then I'll probably catch you guys on our flight. Cutest airport ever. <laughs> Just picking up our rental. We have a really nice red Chevy Cruze. And there are the mountains. It's so beautiful. Here we go. So we got some chips and guacamole and salsa and a vegan Reuben sandwich to share, which looks freakishly realistic. We just checked in at Rainbow Ranch Lodge. It's so cute. We have a riverside room. It's called Mountain Lion. We've got the bathroom, nice big bed, lounge area, fireplace. I think we had like the option of choosing two beds, but there was a couch. Yeah, that's, that's right. Yeah, we chose this and that was the trade-off we made. It was yeah. to share a bed. Yeah, the trade-off we made was that we got a ground floor room, which is much nicer for access to the river and just carrying in our very heavy luggage. But the trade-off was that we had to share a bed, which is fine. And here is the best part. Check this out. <gasps> so nice. This is the Gallatin River. So we can sit out here at the end of the day, listening to the sounds of the river. And we can also sleep to the sounds of the river. We're going to check out the river. I'm really hoping to see a grizzly bear from a safe distance. It's like my dream. It's a new dream that has developed since we arrived. And now we can see our cabin. There's our room. Here is our breakfast. They just have a little breakfast buffet here. They do have house-made granola, bagels, and some other bread. 
I grabbed these two bananas because they were so ripe. We have our own vanilla almond milk that we brought with us and some orange juice. This lighting is, I'm like blue on one half of my face and then kind of like yellow on the other. Hmm. Okay, hey guys, so it's our first full day here in Big Sky, Montana. I'm wearing a thermal black long sleeve, which is quite thin. And then I had this really warm cream knit as well, which I will show you. Yeah, I was wearing this earlier this morning, but I think it's a little bit too warm for it now. I'm wearing my favorite Zella leggings that you guys have seen many times before. I've got this puffer vest. And then my trusty feeler sneakers, of course. And kind of like minimal makeup. Sunglasses on, ready to go. We're on the road. I drove yesterday, so Holly is kindly driving today. Holly and I think that this river, the Gallatin River, surrounded by all these trees and the mountains, it looks just like the Pixar movie, The Good Dinosaur. I just have to film the mountains again because they're so amazing. We can't get over how beautiful. Photos and video don't do it justice. This is gonna be pretty boring for everyone watching, that's the thing, but when you're seeing it in IRL, it's pretty cool. It's so quiet. I guess it is Sunday and also kind of the off season. Just grabbed a soy chai latte from the Hungry Moose. So this is the Big Sky Town Center. And we're just chilling here. It's like a ghost town. <laughs> it's so quiet. How cute is this little theater? I was just saying how I thought these trash cans were a little odd because you have to touch them so much. I didn't like the idea of that. But then I realized they are bear safe. So they're nice and sealed up so it doesn't attract the bears. Oh yes, they have McDougal's noodles. <laughs> we're very happy about this. I've never heard of this brand, Nana's. They have no eggs, no dairy, and they are labeled vegan. That's cool. We're gonna go check out Usul Falls. Lotus pad and we're gonna see what things we can get vegan or customize vegan. Here we have our pad thai with tofu, no egg and no cilantro. So we just finished dinner and we went to the supermarket to pick up some dessert. We're trying these Rice Dream Vanilla Bites and I also picked up some snacks. We got a couple of these Nana's cookies. We got one chocolate and one lemon. And I also got this Bobo's maple pecan oat bar, which I've never tried before. I don't think I've even, I don't think I've ever heard of this brand. They had a lot of really good vegan stuff at that supermarket. And then we also picked up Huckleberry Jam, which is a gift for my dad because he always likes edible gifts. Now we're gonna eat our ice cream. Hmm. I'm not like the biggest fan of rice milk ice cream but they're still really good. And it's been raining out. We were really lucky actually, we just missed the rain. So we're just gonna chill and eat our ice cream bites. Breakfast day two with a view. Pretty much the same thing as yesterday. And I also made a cup of tea today. Day two in Montana. Outfit is not that different yesterday. Feel the sneakers, leggings. I'm wearing a thermal long sleeve top and then this knit. My cozy 
weekday hoodie. And then I've also got my puffer vest over the top. And oh, we're going to Yellowstone National Park today. Like the aesthetic of like those ones. Oh, and those ones too. Like that three wolf moon aesthetic. <laughs> oh, I like this one. It's like a retro yeah. one. Yeah, that's really nice. my packed lunch. I've got some applesauce, peanut butter, jelly sandwich. It's so quiet. I got my cookie under there, my vegan cookie. mood am I? It's always blue I feel like whenever I put on a mood ring. Blue. Surprise, surprise. <laughs> We've got our pizza, which is potato, rosemary and sage, and tomato with a marinara base, no cheese obviously, and our salad, which is just, yeah, pretty self-explanatory. Just like last night, we stopped by Roxy's Market to pick up something for dessert, and tonight we're trying this mint pie by Rice Dream. Here it is. So it's rice dream vanilla ice cream sandwiched between two oatmeal cookies and they're very soft as well. And it's covered in dairy-free chocolate. Delicious. Muffin. This is the rest of the buffet. And there's a bunch of stuff that we can't eat. Waffles and bacon. On this oatmeal. I might actually give this a go today. There's the dog we met yesterday, but I didn't get to vlog it. Really cute husky. The dog has one kind of um, injured leg, but still um, is able to run very well. So cute, very friendly. in for lunch this isn't like a vegan specific place but they have a pretty big menu and we're gonna see what we can customize we got some pita pit from Bozeman and we've come back to the lodge 
and we're just chilling on our little uh, patio by the Gallatin River. pack up my bag because we're heading back to LA tomorrow. I thought I'd show you guys my tiny little Target haul. I got this backpack. All the bags and accessories and jewelry were 20% off. And then I also got this little faux fur fuzzy keychain. It's like a pale pink. And I also picked up this e.l.f. Aqua Beauty Primer Mist. And that's about it for my little Target haul. Let's take one last look at the Gallatin River from our room. Bye bye, until next time.